Another vision? I must be one of the servants. Yes. Your turn? The servants are not very efficient. Durache can't be far away. They'll find her soon. Their search time is restricted, given that they must keep an eye on Adams. I can take care of her, you know. Yes. Well, in any case, I do thank you for bringing her to the island. From what I've understood, the search of de Richet's room hasn't turned up any results. Not yet, no. But we've put her son in there. Perhaps he'll find something. Hmm. That might come in handy. Louis grows impatient at not yet having met the famous Lord Mortimer. He will this meet is him happening tomorrow. right now. Oh, what a pity to lose a knight at the start of the game. Are you waiting for someone? A young French soldier. During our game of chess? Don't Napoleon. worry, Gregory. The game won't disappear. I'll have one of my men escort you back. Don't trouble yourself. I know my way out. Ah, good evening, gentlemen. Please forgive me for this late hour. It is never too late. And we have much to discuss. One last move? That wasn't Don't very nice. Worry. Our games always seem to end like this. Or always start like this. <laughs> Come, come, take a seat, my friend. They were keeping Lord Mortimer's face hidden. Probably for a reason. Character reveal Napoleon Bonaparte. Nighttime stroll, Mr. President? There's nothing like it for a good night's sleep. Do not hesitate to ask a servant to show you back. The corridors seem quite safe. Peppermint, lime flower, and valerian. My miracle remedy when one can't get to sleep. A very good night to you, Mr. President. Thank you. And to you too, sir. Seriously, what the hell? Are these visions a regular occurrence, or are they just starting? Because if this is just starting, you're taking the fact that I'm you coming. can see things very well. In fact, I think actually Max probably reacted to time travel in Life is Strange yes, better. Mr. Richet, please excuse me, but I am unable to join you at present. However, rest assured that we are doing all we can to resolve the case that concerns us. Circle-shaped key. The last judgment. Why do I always get the most terrifying room? The incredulity of St. Thomas. I'm coming, Thomas Washington! Caravaggio represented St. Thomas putting his finger in the wound. Thomas looks on, but doesn't touch. Still locked in. I am coming! Inferno by Dante. Ah. Abandon hope, all ye who enter here. Lovely lectures Mortimer's giving to his guests. Very jolly. Amber crystals. Nice. That does it for that water I had, but it was worth it. Excuse me, am I bothering you? No, not in the least. Is something wrong? I'm going to need your help. Do you remember the young lady we spoke of in the hall? Adams? Elizabeth Adams. Home introduced her to us. Yes. Well, she is the daughter of my friend, the Vice President, John Adams. But she is supposed to be dead. Yeah, that's bizarre. Fair enough. Good heavens! I was present at her funeral. 
It is disturbing indeed. Yes. I need to make sure it's her. That's where you come in. I want you to distract Elizabeth while I search her room. And perhaps get my hands on some important information. At least, I hope so. Elizabeth is in the small salon. If you hurry, you can still catch her. I just need ten minutes. But if my vision is true, there are two men nearby discussing very important issues, and one of them looks much like Mortimer. Washington is very kind, but I came to this island for my mother, not for his ghost stories. Again, I'm kind of biased, because I'm an American, and I love Washington. Who doesn't love Washington? But Mortimer will be revealed soon. Although he is speaking to Napoleon of all people. Mm, but helping Washington could be beneficial to me in the future. Back Count on me, back. sir. Thank you, my friend. Keep Elizabeth Choices. downstairs as long as possible. She must not return to her room. Trust me. Looks like we're gonna get a uh, confrontation. According to Washington, Lady Adams is in the small salon. I better hurry. Trophy Aaron, son of Lafayette. Monseigneur, his eminence, Cardinal Piaggi. Louis, you're straying from your objective. Oops. Duke Manuel Godoy. Sounds like someone's yelling. Saturn devouring his son. Good God, how awful. Everything in this painting is disturbing. It's the first time I've seen brushstrokes like this. Ah, my son. Oh, you are a godsend. What's the matter, Your Eminence? I believe a Miss Adams may be in danger. What so do why don't you go in and help? She is being manhandled in this small salon. By so whom? Go in and I help. don't know exactly. Uh, a thug, a Frenchman, it seems. By the cut of his claw, I'd say he's a member of the French Revolutionary Government. You should do something, my son. Why don't you do something? Shit. I was supposed to make sure Adams wouldn't go back to her room. Don't worry, Your Eminence. I'll take care of it. Probably nothing to worry about. Do you want me to call for help? Please don't do anything. I'm sure with a little goodwill, everything will work out fine. Don't go and wake up the whole manor, please. Oh, thank you, my son. May God watch over you. <laughs> Who do you think you are? Forget Multiple paths. There are multiple paths to reach your objective. It may be a good idea to think twice before embarking on the first path you come to. Me, sir. If we were in France, I'd have sent you to the guillotine for what you just said. Please, just let me go back to my room. Hey, you! Stay out of it! This is none of your business! I'm gonna teach this little slut how to behave! What the hell is going on? Huh? I don't think you know who I am! Stop! I beg you. I, I didn't mean to. Don't hit me, please, sir. Shit. Uh, if I step in, Adams might just run back uh, to her room. And if I do nothing, yes, Washington will have enough time to search, but this girl's gonna uh, suffer. Damn it. What should I do? Uh, I'm gonna be... Uh, I don't want to be an uh, asshole. You filthy whore! I apologize. Have mercy. Please have mercy. Uh, no! Immoral. I'm no! sorry. I'm sorry. I apologize. No, no, no. Mercy. Have mercy. No, no, no. Where's that smart mouth now? I'll teach you a little respect. No. Huh? No. Huh? Look, you dumbass. Are you deaf? 
She said she was sorry. Call me that again. <laughs> Leave her alone. Are you looking for a slap, Sonny? Why am I doing this? Boxer, sweet. Leave me alone. I think I just managed to piss both of them off. Washington must have finished by now. Chacu Peru. Yeah, there he is. Well, did you get time to search the room? Yes, I found out many things. Good. Did Elizabeth give you any trouble? Elizabeth? No. Well, you could have mentioned she was the raving maniac, huh? What do you mean? She was with a Frenchman. He was about to beat her when I arrived. What the devil are you talking about? I thought he was going to kill the poor girl. Did you intervene? I did what was necessary to give you enough time to search her room. Good work, my friend. I knew that I could count on you. So tell me, did you find any information? Oh, yes. What I found is likely to upset you. What do you mean by that? Elizabeth is indeed the daughter of John Adams. Why pass her off as dead? I found her medical file. It appears that for many years, your mother was her personal doctor. From what I read, she behaved more like a butcher than a doctor. What are you talking about? I'm not a child. What's going on here? John believed that his daughter was possessed. He appealed to your mother to save her, but the treatment she inflicted on the poor child... My God. Look, stop beating around the bush. What exactly did she do to her? Do you believe your mother capable of torturing a child? I guess I have My to. My mother got her hands dirty for the common good, so don't be too quick to judge her. For the common good? We're talking about the vivisection of a child. Of tattooing her from head to foot with a red hostile. Stop, stop this. For her fifth birthday, she inflicted the stigmata of Christ on her. And for her tenth birthday, a hysterectomy. What kind of gift is that My for a My mother's child? not a monster. I do not doubt that your mother meant well. But the techniques described in the file, it, it is pure torture. Uh, please, I need some time alone. I have seen some horrors in my time. But if what is written in these damn documents is true, be brave, my boy. Hmm. I'm... I'm not sure... I should totally believe him. But then again, I don't really have a reason to not believe him. Blind Oedipus. Blinded himself. What a tragic destiny. Fall of the Damned by Rubens. The man who cannot achieve the salvation of God the Father is offered to fall into the depths of the abyss. Duchess Emily Hillsborough. While I'm here, let me look at the character of um, Jacques Peru. Jacques Peru is one of the fathers of the Revolutionary Tribunal in Paris. During the terror, he quickly became one of the most worrying figures in all of Paris. He distinguished himself by taking part in the siege of the Bastille and the capture of Louis XVI, the current king of France. He was involved in the creation of the Revolutionary Tribunal. He is a man of law or torturer. Nobody dares say. Oh, is he a man of law or torturer? Nobody dares say. This judge of the people has overseen many trials that sent opponents and traitors of the revolution to the guillotine. 
Peru interrupts his revolutionary activities when Lord Mortimer, his patron, invites him to join the latter's social gatherings. Uh, did that happen to give any weaknesses towards him? No. I thought it was a weakness would be punch to the gut, but I guess that doesn't really count as a weakness. Your Eminence, what are you doing here? I was worried about you, my son. Uh, how did it go with Miss Adams? It could have went better. Ah, uh, boy. Uh, You're right. Some ill-mannered ape was clearly threatening her. I had to intervene. I hope that your eminence will forgive me. I had to resort to violence. It was the only language he seemed to understand. I won't hold it against you. Did what you could. But the situation called for quick action. But not from you. Of course, uh, I personally disapprove of any form of violence. But I am sure that what you did was for the best. My son, I have another problem. I wanted to speak to you about something important. Do you still have my letter on you? No one ah, you come on. on. Why do you ask? I have a name to add to it. Uh, son of a bitch! Damn it! Nope. Damn. Okay, well, what about the water? No, son of a bitch, I use that too. Fuck, damn it. I'm gonna get him so pissed at me. Fuck. Oh well. Here, here it is. You opened it! Don't worry about that, Your Eminence. You gave me your word, before God! I can assure you that my mother and I share everything. That's enough! Your word is worthless. I give your mother this letter myself. Well, that sucked. Fuck. Huh, that's me. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. I'm exhausted. I better go to bed. I'll search my room tomorrow. If Mother stayed here right before me, you never know. And Mortimer had better show up. Something about that painting. Trophy earned, rough night. Success, I have found Lady Adams in the small saloon. I I prevented Lady Adams from returning to her room. I knocked Peru flying. I heard Mr. Washington talking about my mother. Failed, I let Lady Adams take a beating. I didn't pick Lady Ad Adams' talisman up. Diego realized I had opened his letter. Alternate paths, I could have found out more about the men of my vision. I could have found out more about plans involving myself. I could have had a remarkable encounter. Well, I made it to level three. Four available points. I'll do that. Here we go. And let's do one more down here. vision yesterday I saw that mother had this room before me I better search the room who knows maybe she left me something behind all right your next reading Uh, 
Uh, no. Okay, so I can't. Okay, so that's permanent. You're annoying people by their physio physiognomy. Let's do that. 